Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Xbox Ultimate Controller to your PC wirelessly. Now, what we want to do is go down to the Start button right here and select this, then go to Settings. Then open up this page and go to Bluetooth Devices on the left side of the screen. Then go on over under Bluetooth Devices and go to Add a Device and select this. Then go to Bluetooth, Audio Devices, Mice, Keyboard, Phones, and Controllers right here and select this. Now your computer is searching for a Bluetooth device to connect to. Let's place our Xbox controller into the pairing mode. So here is my ultimate controller right here. I'm going to turn this on. Then what I want to do is hold down the sync button on the top of the controller. So if I hold this down, the light will begin to flash and only hold this down for about three seconds. So the light is flashing quickly. Let's go over to my computer now and it should be discoverable. So I can see Xbox wireless controller right here under add a device. Let's select it says it's connecting and it should be connected. So my controller is now connected. Now you can press the Xbox button just to see if this is working. Now you can turn off the controller simply by holding down the Xbox button right here. And after about five to six seconds, the controller will turn off and you should be good to go. Now, if you do have a problem with connecting your controller, you may wanna go ahead and first reset the controller. And to reset the controller, you wanna hold down the sync button right here on the top for at least six seconds. So if we hold this down, the light is gonna to begin to flash. Then after about six seconds, it's gonna turn off and the controller is gonna vibrate. And this is gonna disconnect it from any other devices connect to. So if it's connected to your phone or your Xbox, now turn on the controller and then hold down the sync button once again for three seconds and the light should begin to flash and you should be able to find it on your computer now. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. Did leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.